Hello, I'm Andrew Wilson at Silent Seven Games, and here I have test copy from the printer of Quest Awakening of Meliore. So I'm going to open it up, and we'll take a look, see what works and what doesn't. Here we go. Hopefully everything is perfect. Now this is printed digitally instead of the traditional method, so it's going to be a little different. Box looks pretty nice. You can see some spot UV coating on there. Looks good. Don't think we had a stretch goal for that, but I thought it'd be nice. Mm. Here, let's look at the sides. So he's a little cut off. Registration's not quite perfect. They said that's part of the digital printing. But the UV is pretty lined up. Honestly, it's not too bad if that curls around the bottom a little bit on that lip. He's pretty deep there. I guess it's kind of a big dinosaur hanging off the edge. See the rest of them <laughs> under there. All right. There's the rule book. Some cards. The dice the game will come with. Those are exactly what I had in mind. You get the five black dice to roll with. We'll put them on the cards in a second to try that out. Got some business cards. All right. Hmm, we got a surprise card here. Let's put that off to the side. Here's the Rainbow Veil promo card. Rainbow Verge now, I renamed it. It's very pretty. All right. Curls looks good. The cards feel nice. I like that sound and that sound. Nina and Mona. We have Tevis. There's a tracker card. The registration on that looks pretty good. Everything fits. It's a tight fit in there, but it's the starting side. And some event cards. Alright, so we know what these look like. Let's take a look at something else here. We have a 
XP token cards. They look different, so you can keep track in your XP whether it's uh, fresh or or used to level already. Let's see some of the artwork on these encounter cards. Glow mount. And some events. Some of the cards are all mixed up, but that happens most games. You gotta sort them out initially. At least it's not a deck building game with tons of stacks to go through. This guy's a little dark, but the artwork's dark. Overall, I'm pretty happy with these colors. The iconic bear of squirrels. It's the bear of squirrels is the first artwork I think of when I think about quest. Dangerous flint meld saurian. All right, this is pretty neat. I didn't even ask for this kind of box insert thing, but it's glued in. There's plenty of room if you want to sleeve the cards and it's going to hold two stacks so you can have your encounter deck and your event deck to figure out where to put the characters I suppose. Try out the dice in a second. Let's look through the rule book. The back of the rule book is the quick start um, guide here. We got If you want to refer to it real quickly um, it re remind you of the, the phases of a turn um, with page references and then a short description so if you wanted you could even just try to learn from this um, you'll probably have to look a lot of stuff up though in that case but hopefully this will be helpful oh, and this looks quite nice To read through it again in in paper form, and of course I've read it, proofread it several times, but having it in paper will be another opportunity for proofreading. Some Kickstarter backers listed down here. By some, I mean all. Benefits of a small Kickstarter is we can fit everybody. All right. A little bit of a character background story page. It's not very thorough, but get to show off some of the artwork bigger than even on the back of the cards, the full art. All right. Let's try out the dice. I'm gonna make a test roll. Zebra Amelior. Roll five dice. All right, I got a four and a six. And they fit. 
perfectly. They fit perfectly. To get a close up. This was one of our big concerns. I'm gonna make sure the dice fit snugly. Let's uh, re-roll this one to a five. I'm gonna call that a re-roll. And yeah, that is a nice, nice fit. Do an encounter just to. Here. Of course, you don't have to put it exactly in, but if you feel it necessary, that is an option. Very nice. All right, well, I think that is good for now. If you have any opinions, of course, make a comment. Um, be looking through to look for anything, any other issues, but it looks pretty good, so we should be able to print soon.